Hey guys, Technomentary here with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys how to download an app on your iPhone 12 Pro or any iPhone that you have. As you can see here in my hand is the iPhone 12 Pro that we recently did an unboxing. Make sure you guys check that video out to see a full detail and specs of the iPhone 12 Pro and if it's worth upgrading or not. So to download an app on your iPhone, it's pretty straightforward, but there's a couple of things you need to know. First thing you need to know is that all Apple apps are downloaded through what's known as the App Store. On Android phones, it's like Google or Samsung Store is where you download it. But on iPhones, it's always going to be App Store. So first thing you want to do is simply open up the App Store. And once you open up the App Store, you'll see all of these apps. And what you can do is search up an app. But even before you do that, you want to make sure that you see that person up there that you actually signed into an Apple account. So you, you cannot download any app without sign into an Apple account. If you have an Apple account, you can sign into it using the Apple ID and password. And if you don't have one, you can simply create one for free, but you definitely need an Apple ID to download app. So since we already have one, we're not gonna create one, but you can always create one by simply hitting that create button and following those directions. So once you do that, it'll ask you to go through this setup menu. But for our purposes, we're gonna go ahead and sign into one of our accounts here. So it's right now signing into a account. So as you can see, we're signed into our default Technomentary account. And once you're signed in, now you're ready to download any apps that you want. So to download a specific app, you want to do is go see that search button. You can go ahead, click that, and then you can search up an app that you want. For example, if we want to download TikTok, right? You can simply search up TikTok and then you'll notice here um, the app pops up. As I have it downloaded here, I can just simply open it up. But let's say you wanted to download something else besides that. Let's say you wanted to download a new game or something like that. You can search it up or let's say a new productivity tool. For example, let's say we want to download this app called Offer up, simply search it up, and then what you're gonna do is click that get button. Once you click that get button, you'll see that install pop up, or sometimes it'll might ask you for the actual account password. You can hit that install button and it will start downloading, and you'll be able to see the app download on your screen. So if we do that app and hit that button here, as you can see, we'll hit install. As you can see, we need to enter our password again for this account. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. So as you can see, we have put the password and then we're gonna hit the sign in again and it's gonna hit done. And once it does that, you see that spinning thing right now, it means it's starting to download an app and we should see that come up any moment here. As you can see, it just has this pop-up come up. You can, about how long you want the password to be required. We'll just say always require. Doesn't really matter what option you pick. And as you can see, now it's starting to download. You can click on that to stop the download, but we're not gonna do that. So simply we're gonna figure out where this is downloading. As you can see, it's downloading here. And then simply we can actually move it from the app library and add it to the home screen. As you can see here, now it's at the home screen and we're good to go. So you might have to do that on iOS 14 is simply hit that if it doesn't show up here. And we can download and start using this app called OfferUp and we're good to go. Hopefully this video is helpful. If this video is helpful, please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe button, also that uh, comment below in the comment section if you have any other questions. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time.